Hey, how you doing today? I am Tequila Coleman. In today's video, I'm going to answer one of our God or Dane spouse question. Here's the question. Hi, Tequila. I was wondering if my I was wondering if my kingdom spouse and I are in divine separation right now with no communication at all. Can I feel his emotion? His grandfather passed away two days ago, and I have been so depressed today. I am not sure if it's because of my own feelings or my kingdom spouse feeling. So thank you for sending in your question. To answer your question, yes, you can feel your spouse's emotions, okay? Um, and you may also be picking up on some of his feelings, right? The depression um, you're feeling, you know, this is really the grieving stages, right? The five stages of grief are anger, depression, um, denial, acceptance, and bargaining, right? So he's grieving right now. He's grieving his grandfather's passing, you know, and you also, you know, feeling these feelings uh, of depression because you probably already knew how he felt about his grandfather, you know, how he, his love he had for his grandfather, you know, and you know how it's impacting him and your heart truly desire to be there for your God or dang spouse. However, the two of you are in a divine separation. So it's almost as if you are grieving for him as well, you know, um, but yes, you can feel your God or dang spouse's emotion. You know, a lot of you ask me, but well, how can I tell the difference? You tell the difference, but between your feelings and your spouse's feelings by you have to know yourself. You have to, you know, be in tune with your own emotions, right? You have to know like on an everyday basis, how am I, you know, normally feeling, right? Are you the type that is normally upbeat, you know, joyful, happy, having that bubbly personality? Uh, and if so, then you already know if depression hit you, if you just, angry all of a sudden or just irritable you know that just come upon you out of out of out of the blue you already know something is in the air you know something is going on you're nine times out of ten you are feeling what your spouse is feeling right so we gotta we gotta learn how to sit alone with ourselves get in tune with our own emotions you know and just be able to discern you know whether or not what i'm feeling in this moment is my emotions or my spouse's emotion okay but like i said you're feeling this depressed, uh, this depression is coming upon you because your your spouse he's grieving the passing of his grandfather, and this is just one of those stages in the grieving process, okay? Um, you know, and it just it's coming upon you. I will rebuke the spirit of depression off of him in the name of Jesus Christ. I rebuke the spirit of anxiety, that I will rebuke the spirit of sadness, loneliness. Uh, I will also rebuke the spirit of suicide. Uh, offer your God ordained spouse. Not saying he's going to commit that, but just in case the devil try to torment his mind, I would go ahead and be one step ahead of the enemy and rebuke off of your spouse all of these uh, demonic spirits, okay? And just cover him in prayer. Pray and ask God, you know, to be there with your spouse, you know, during this time of his grandfather's passing, get him peace, comfort him, call on the Holy Spirit and ask Holy Spirit to comfort your spouse, you know, uh, while you, you know, because you can't be there for him. Okay. And God will do it. Okay. He will advocate on your behalf. All right. So that is my advice. I am Tequila Coleman. I'll talk to you all real soon. Take care.